Amen. Well, let's begin with a word of prayer. Father, uh, how precious it is that we can come and celebrate the achievements of young children and the hard work that they've had for so many months. Lord Jesus, you, you said, don't forbid the children to come unto you. When the adults were trying to shun them, you said, bring them to me. And you said, for such is the kingdom of heaven. And Lord, we know that the gospel is so simple that the only way we can get to heaven is to receive the gospel just like a child. And Lord, when we, we get older, we tend to think in things like a faith. And so, Father, we just come tonight, and I want to thank you for the children, their parents, their families. I want to thank you for the workers, uh, Lord, and how what we're about to see is, uh, Lord, the efforts of many months of hard work. Uh, bless our time. Bless these young people, Lord Jesus, and I pray that, Father, what they have learned in terms of Bible memory and instruction will serve them all the days of their life, and they'll always bring you grace, power, and glory in every way. And this we pray in your precious name. Amen. You may be seated.
going to pray for Mr. Mike that's back to church again. Um, my papa is, uh, has to go, has to have chemotherapy and, uh, but he has to do it at Birmingham with the pill or here without a pill. But if that doesn't work, he has to do a cell plant transaction. So I just hope that either one, either one of them will work. I'm just glad that Mr. Mike is finally home back to his church. Hope that my dad gets better. Dear Heavenly Father, Lord, thank you for all these parents, grandparents, and guardians of the kids here, especially for the one of the leaders that have taught them this year. And I want to pray that we will use your word this year to guide us. Please remember all the prayer requests that were mentioned tonight. Amen. As our older kids form out, our little ones, we're going to start. Y'all can go ahead. We're going to start our ceremony off with our two-year-old Puggles group. All right? Y'all hold on one second. That way. Well. Oops. All right, we're going to ask our two-year-olds to come forward. Now, the two-year-old director is my sister, Donna Kempner. Donna, would you like to come back for a few minutes and say bye, bye to your children? Donna's been out uh, about five or six weeks, as we know, with Mr. Mike. He's been sick, and he's been in the hospital. So um, these ladies have done a great job in your absence. I, have, I want to tell you that. They have done a great job, so we'll give them a hand. So these are your four little ones here. So, y'all want to tell us a little bit about what y'all think? Okay, here we go. Like I said, I've been missing for a few weeks, quite a few. Uh, Miss Tina and Miss Cynthia has been handling everything very well, I see. From I hear Miss Chan said y'all been doing really good. Uh, we do teach the kids that God's creations. Um, I haven't been here, like I said, so <laughs> I am a little nervous and... Uh, we're going to do the God's creations and do our finger play and hope we do that well as uh, we can. <laughs> so, Tina, you want to come down? Hey, girl, you look Miss Donna. Okay, guys, now we're going to do our finger play for everybody. Come on, you want to stand up? Come on, stand up. You can do it. Come on, get down.
right, so our two-year-olds, Dom, first I want to thank Cynthia and Tina for doing such a good job while I was gone. Thank you very, very much. God has really blessed these kids because of y'all being just them, okay? another hand. They're a little shy at that age, but by the time they get to us in the older group, they're not shy anymore. Isn't that right, Bonnie Grace? Yep. All right, so I want to, y'all hang on one second. Y'all can go sit with mamas and daddies. Okay, if y'all see them, don't run. We have, um, I want to recognize service awards for our leaders. Miss Donna Kentner's been with Awana for seven years, so she gets her seven years service award pin. Tina Whitehead. Tina is actually one of our teenagers that is a leader in training that started with our LIT program this year. So thank you, Tina. Great job. Future leader. And Miss Cynthia, her first year with us as well as a full leader. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. So they start out really young, and our two-year-old program teaches them about God's creation and the first days on the earth. And then we move to our preschoolers, which is our three, four, and five-year-olds, our cubby.